I have all good sessions today. Hope you found it helpful. As we said, at address, we're going to try to get a little bit more tilt with the spine. Get that left shoulder and left hip a little bit higher than the right side. Just put a bit more weight onto your back foot. It's going to square your shoulders up and obviously help you in the back so we know how to turn and keep the weight on the right side. What we have on the left hand image now, if we look at the swing, as you went back now, because you couldn't load your back swing as much as you were now with a tilted spine, as you came into the hitting area, a lot of your weight now be sort of falling back onto your trail foot. You can see impact here now catching top of the golf ball and the club now going to flip over in a lot of shots to the left there. And most of your weight now, as we said, favouring that back foot, as we can see, spine angle certainly leaning back behind the golf ball. What I try to do is get that weight favouring the right side to start with. Then as we stay there, we can load the back swing a lot easier. Now we get a much better shoulder turn and into our right side. So if, because we move back on the way back, we can now move to target on the way through. As you can see, there's a shift now down towards your left side. We don't quite come through as much as we could, but certainly a much more solid conduct impact as we can see there. And we can rotate through up onto that left side, getting a bit more weight up onto that lead foot. So if we can work on that setup, get that spine angle slightly tilted, then we just shift our weight to target, get a much more consistent ball flight without that ball going a long way left. So hope that helps. Any questions, give me a shout, and I'll see you soon.